This morning, the Texas Panhandle War Memorial hosted a ceremony honoring and thanking area veterans for their service. KAMR Local 4's Kaylee Green has more from the celebration, plus reflections from veterans. That story as we honor our hometown heroes tonight. <laughs> veterans were honored with a flyover by Panhandle Warbird Flight, and Gold Star families were also presented with flowers during the ceremony. After a greeting by Congressman Ronnie Jackson. Thank you to all our veterans for your service to our country. Who served as a rear admiral in the Navy, then a keynote address from Ken Teal, a retired Army colonel. I really hope that each one of you would look back and just recall some of those special moments, especially the time when you were introduced to military service, that you would remember the pride that you earned in earning the symbols and emblems that showed you belonged to an organization dedicated to a cause greater than yourselves. Colonel Till also took the time to honor those who were actively serving. I celebrate this service and sacrifice of all who are veterans and who have served. And I reflect on the resilience and dedication and valor and fidelity of young men serving today, young men and women. They will be veterans when their service is over. And they're performing their duties in the finest traditions of the military service. We asked another veteran, James Graham, what Veterans Day means to him. Uh, it's, it's very significant. I mean, it's honoring our freedom. Uh, everyone here uh, from, from Young to old, I mean, we owe, we owe veterans. I just, just thank a veteran. If you see him, thank him. Let them know you care. The War Memorial also got a new addition today. The ceremony also included the dedication of a Doughboy statue. Live in studio, Kaylee Green, KMR Local 4 News. Jackie. Kaylee, thank you. Hundreds attended the celebration, all to say thank you for your service to our local veterans.